Welcome to the Holter Museum of Art. My name is Ramsey. I'm the Exhibition and Collection Manager here. Right now, we have Jeff Corwin's photography exhibit, Guns in America, inhabiting the Millican, Nicholson, and Held galleries here in the museum. This is a photography exhibit. Mr. Corwin inherited uh, three guns from his father after he passed away. Um, and not having a strong relationship with guns, he felt somewhat uncomfortable owning them and so stored them in the basement for a number of years. And before deciding that he was finally going to get rid of them, his artist friend recommended that he photograph them first. And so he began building sets and photographing the work while he was in a studio in Seattle. And it took a long time and finally something started to happen. And so he started building these sets drastically lighting them and, um, and photographing them. And over time, this exhibit was started in 2012 when he started building the work and he's continuing to contribute to it still. Um, and it started to tell these stories of guns in America, the deep history and traditions that America has in their history. All of the pieces are untitled because the artist does not want to tell a specific story, but more wants the viewer to bring their own stories to the work. And so each piece has an American flag represented, often has a clock, um, and features a gun in some way, shape, or form. A lot of the pieces will feature dolls or different figures as well. Some feature photographs. Um, so the artist often goes to thrift stores and just finds Americana um, objects and collects them to build these sets and then takes them into his studio and reworks them and remakes them into these final photographs. So some of them are quite moving. One pattern that we've seen here as we've housed the work is as people come in um, we're noticing that it becomes a real sharing platform of people's experience with guns, their relationship with guns themselves, how guns have impacted them personally which has been a really unexpected and um, kind of beautiful occurrence. And um, so as you walk through this exhibit, it is emotional, it is quiet, and it has often elicited a response in viewers. So I welcome you to, to walk through it and enjoy it with me. So I can talk a little bit about Mr. Carwin's process as he builds these sets. Um, these are two photographs that are extremely striking and um, definitely caused pause. These are one of the few instances where Mr. Corwin has representational imagery of, um, of people that would be recognizable to the public. Most of the imagery and pictures that he includes in his photographs are of anonymous people of anonymous photographs that he's culled from thrift stores. Um, and this one is that exception. He does not name the people in the exhibit, um, not wanting to give her heroship to, to the subjects, but also wanting to notice. Um, and as he builds his sets, often like this bowl that encompasses the figures is a thrifted item. And then he often uses toy guns as well. Um, so this is, this one is not a real gun, it's a toy gun that would be very recognizable to very many people um, of a certain generation where that was highly produced, little cap guns for kids. But also reminiscent of like how, I mean that's such a personal connection to viewers to see that particular object which is so familiar to so many. And then also paired with the Bible, the flag, and these um, impactful images.
Thank you for walking through Guns in America with me, featuring the photography work of Jeff Corwin. He is a Cardwell-based artist. He grew up in Los Angeles, spent 28 years in Seattle. He was a commercial photographer and has flown all over the world photographing on site. Um, and in the last 15 years has settled into some studio work as well alongside his commercial photography. So I'd invite you to come and explore the Nicholson, Held, and Milliken galleries that are filled with his photographic work. And um, it will be open until September 11th. Thank you.